versus Kasev's Fox. This is a very interesting matchup. Um, I see this one played out a lot. Diddy has fantastic stage control in this matchup, but Fox can just kill Diddy. Like, so he has such great setups on him. Someone altering the random stage select? <laughs> um, and they could be doing the Japanese method of stage striking. Have you uh, seen that at, like, Genesis? Where they, like, they cross off the stages? Yes. It, like, kind of removes the language barrier a okay. little bit. Okay, that makes sense now. But, like, they, spoke, they both speak English, so I don't... <laughs> yeah, I mean... Just the strong, silent types, I guess. All right, so Diddy Kong Fox going to start off on Final Destination. This is Kasev's favorite stage, at least to my knowledge. A um, little surprised that Rog would let him go here, but maybe he likes it too. Rog probably wants that flat, sta that flat stage so uh, he can just throw the banana around and not really have to worry about platforms. That's probably right. Some people also have that Poor Glory effect where they're just so used to flat stages for playing so for, for, on Poor Glory that just, they just don't like the idea of platforms. Kasev opening up with a couple of Fox Rapid Jabs. Uh, Raw getting a couple of grabs, racking up some solid percentage. Definitely probably should have. I think he could have gotten some more damage there instead of just throwing him off stage. But he's got a solid lead to start out this game. Raw doing a nice job spacing out Kasev here. I think Kasev's just trying to find a feel for this match here. Right. Wow, very nice. Run behind F tilt. Oh, okay, so... Uh, Diddy Kong definitely playing this neutral a lot better than Kasev is right now. Yeah, Kasev <laughs> just seems to, he hasn't really found his footing yet. Oh, wow. Oh, uh, oh, that's going to be the stock. Oh, man, that is so unfortunate. You know he wanted that ledge, but it just didn't work out for him. I could feel a momentum switch coming. Oh, yeah. Who knows, though? If Rog can get a nice setup, maybe down tilt up smash, about, say, like 20, 34%, that's going to kill. Yeah. If you can do that real quick, maybe it's not so bad. I mean, this is Kasev. Yeah, uh, Kasev definitely has a lot of experience in this matchup, I believe, because he's a no-no. Oh, absolutely. But every every person plays their character slightly different. Exactly. Oh, okay. Oh, I saw. I respect the, the attempt. He almost got it. I don't think he would have made it back if he landed it, though. It's quite possible. A down tilt up smash will probably kill Fox here, especially with a little bit of rage. Um, pretty close. Oh, a, a back, back air is going to take it. Fox dies a lot easier off the side than he does on off the top. I think FZ has fast shorter horizontal edges as well. Yeah, actually, um, I'm not sure. I think I've heard it's. I've heard both things, so I don't know what to believe anymore. Uh, there was a guy that like actually did like a uh, like a star ranking system for every stage. Did he? For like horizontal, diagonal, and uh, vertical. Okay. So and uh, this one has shorter blast zones on the side? I, I can't remember. I All I know is wow, I know Town nice City crap. is the the shortest vertical ceiling. Correct. And followed by Smashville. Okay. I don't know. I'm not sure what Rog ate there that killed him. Looked like maybe an up smash? I think it was an up smash. Okay. Now if I'm Rog, I'm not feeling too bad about that. Yeah, he um, definitely won the beginning of that game. Yeah, he had a the great lead, and then he just had an unfortunate accident with the barrels. Um, don't we all? I on it, yeah. <laughs> I honestly wouldn't be opposed to seeing Rog just run it back. Rog, the rocket technician. <laughs> He's our MVD, I guess. Cases? Uh, yeah, he just always does a controller oh, yeah, reset. Control reset. He's notorious for that. I wonder if he does it just like out of like subconscious now. Yeah, it's probably just a ritual for him, you know. Just feel good going to the next game. Got my controller. I wonder, reset. I wonder if he does it and then puts his name back on his character or his his pin and just be like, "Did I reset my controller?" <laughs> <laughs> have to <laughs> like do it again. Instantly forgets. <laughs> yeah, like have to do it again. Yeah, be I feel like that would be something I would do if I did that a lot. Yeah, same here. So we have a decent amount of people showing up for singles. Uh, yeah, got a lot of people showing up. We didn't have the best showing for doubles, but no, a lot of showing up for singles though. The, s the doubles was still hype though. Oh, is that Even the though there wasn't very many people. Oh, it's the Reed Brothers. Awesome. Yeah, they came here with Ally. Oh, they did. Did they? I didn't see them. We got Jordan over there. Mm -hmm. Jordan's vegetarian. I didn't know he was vegetarian until. I did not know that not until now. He's been a vegetarian for four years. Wow. Yeah. Huh. You seem like the kind of guy that would be vegetarian, too. You think you know a guy. Well, that's, that's the nice kind of vegetarian, the ones that aren't talking about it every now and then. That's true. <laughs> I hear that. So, Rog takes him to Omega Dreamland. I've actually seen this pick out of Rog before. 
Maybe he liked FD as a... Oh, my uh, gosh. All right. Well, Rock okay. the rocket technician. <laughs> okay. I'm starting to wonder why he likes this stage. We got Einstein bros. <laughs> yeah, it is going to be pretty rough now. He's going to need a super clutch spike. It's looking like a crew battle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He just found yeah. an entertaining way to SD <laughs> while he was, like, waiting to, for the crew battle. Oh, okay. Take case tech. Always text those. He's got to get a spike. That's the only way he's going to come back. Okay, oh, all right. Awesome, he's back in nice. it. Exactly, you, you just got to go for it. And now Rog has given himself an opportunity to get back into this game. Oh. Yeah, he's at a pretty big, I mean, not so much of a deficit anymore, but I'm sure he's at a mental deficit because of the SDs. Yeah, exactly. The Fox Rapid Jab, possibly the most annoying move in the game. Possibly the best jab in the game. As it's well. amazing. Like it's so jab. good, but it is so annoying. Which is because it's good. <laughs> Captain has a pretty good jab as well. Yes, yes, he does. The rapid jab is not that great, but the, the three piece. Uh, gentlemen. The three piece combo, that's really good. Three piece combo. <laughs> <laughs> so they're both just kind of nice. hopping around, throwing things at each other left and right. This really isn't that far off for Rog. All he needs is, oh my gosh, to not get up into an up smash. All he needs is a few more percent and probably a down tilt up smash. Ooh, nice. Ooh, nice pivot grab. Pivot grab. Just ran right around that man's shield. Very nice combo. Up smash of the ledge is going to kill right now. Okay, uh, jab, jab, up smash. The new Fox classic. It was actually Taking banana, the game. jab, jab, up smash. Banana, jab, jab, up smash. Just add one more piece to the combo so it sounds even better. All right, so okay.